my name is John Tibbs. I'm a senior here at NKU. Um, this collection of artwork I did was what I've done the past uh, year, starting from the beginning of the 2012 semester. Um, and it's kind of the culmination of what I've learned here, which is really nice. Pretty much my high school teacher. Um, went to a high school where the the teacher was very into the arts and very into pushing you to to think outside the box. And I think that's what got me into it. Um, I'm, <laughs> I wanted to be a doctor my freshman year of uh, high school, and that changed quickly as going through high school and you know growing. I guess that wasn't me, but um, yeah. Um, also, my grandmother graduated from NKU with a degree in ceramics in 89, so that was uh, having a family that pushes the arts was very important. The thing that got me really start loving painting is uh, painting from life, solely from observation. Um, I did use some photographs in my series, but the still lives I did were all done from life. And uh, like just that being there, seeing the things and reacting to them, it, it became really powerful. It became like a meditation almost, you know, or a reflection. Um, that's why I got the name of the show from, because I'm reflecting on these, these things from my childhood. Um, but yeah, so painting from life, it really, changed my, my way of looking at art. Cool. The Impressionists, um, big, big time. Uh, Degas, uh, Vuillard, um, Bonard, uh, let's see, Manet, Monet. Um, pretty much the whole Impressionist school from that really, looking at their art, really got me interested in color um, and being able to be not so perfect in the, in the drawing and painting aspect. It was more real, you know? It was, <laughs> painting before the Impressionism was strictly very, very, very highly detailed paintings, you know, of portrait paintings or landscapes that people were buying for ridiculous amounts of money, and it wasn't real. And then impressionist, Impressionism hit, and it was like, there's this new style of painting that real people are doing, and it, it's, it, 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 caught, it caught people's eye, and that's what really was important to me. Um, and then around here, actually, in Cincinnati, I worked for a gallery called Manifest Gallery in um, East Walnut Hills, and through there I met uh, a group of people that have just changed my, my world and views of art. Um, and that's become incredible. Just the having a community is something special. You don't you don't get that everywhere else. It was incredible actually. Like it's it's been huge. Um, my professor Kevin Menti, he he paint, he was the one that kind of got me involved. Um, from the first, from like my, probably my sophomore year, and then junior year I met uh, one of my professors named Rob Anderson, who actually went to high school with me, same high school, but he was much older. And we kind of clicked immediately because we, we got each other, you know, we had the same ideas and the same background kind of. So I, inter I interned at that gallery and my professor Kevin would always be there, oh, you know, kind of like helping me along. And then I met everyone else. And it was just like this really nice blend that, that I, I don't know where else you can get that, you know? Um, NKU has helped a lot. It, it, it's just, when I first came here, I was like, oh, what am I gonna do? I was gonna be a graphic designer, you know? And I, I didn't know what painting really was. And I feel I didn't know what it was until two years ago when I met all those people. And, and that's because of NKU.
I'm gonna take a year off and uh, apply to grad schools, make uh, a lot more work, travel a little bit, maybe get a job, we'll see what happens. Um, but uh, really get my uh, portfolio to a very, very high level and then send it to grad schools. Um, yeah, and probably hopefully attend grad school in uh, fall of 2014. I would say, it's, a, it's a, get the technique down first. Study um, and read. Don't just think that because you're a good artist and people tell you you're, you're good, that that will be the only thing. You, that's what I thought coming into college. And then <laughs> slowly, when I started seeing other people's art and seeing, being, whoa, you know, like, uh, how are they doing this? And it, all it is is studying, you know. Um, that would, that's the most important thing, I would say. It's been a good five years. Um, it's fun. Met a lot of cool people, and um, I'm thrilled I came here. It was it was, it was a great decision.